hello again and welcome back to Fallout London. Standing here with Sean. Talked about Sean in the last episode. I'm going to wait until I get more charisma. See if we can't get more charisma, come back and talk to him later. Because right now it looks like our only option to deal with him is violence. And I don't want to do that. I don't want to resort to violence. So instead, we're going to leave here. And we're going to uh, meet Archie and the ferryman at the fishing dock. You can see it right here on the map. We're not far away from it at all. So let's uh, let's kind of head over in that direction. Here there's a big storm brewing out here. Oh no, actually I'm just now realizing that it is uh, nighttime. It's 10.50 p.m. What am I thinking? No, we're not going to go for a walk at 10.50 p.m. We're going to go back in here to the East Mr. Pindar. And we're going to spend the night in one of these cots. And I looked up Pindar stations, and apparently they're like um, a government kind of surveillance and administration stations in time of war. Um, I don't think there were ever really that many of them in London. Uh, and I believe there's like only one of them that still remains. Um, that was Churchill's place. It's called the Churchill War Rooms. You can go there and check it out if you're in London. We're going to go ahead and sleep for a good eight hours. Get a good night's sleep here before we head back out. Hopefully the storm will have passed. And it'll be daylight. And we won't have to stumble around in the dark. Come on, Churchill. Let's get out of here. Old Sean will probably be still standing here, waiting for something to happen. There he stands. Ooh, it looks like... Oh, Churchill found something. What'd you find, Churchill? Oh, we're going upstairs. Boy, he could find stuff from far away. What is it? Is it this dead body that you found? Is that... Is that what you wanted to tell me about this dead body? Because, gee, thanks. Thanks a lot. Thanks, Churchill. That's, um... Gosh, that is super helpful, Churchill. Is it a newspaper? Did you, do you want me to... Roll up the newspaper and throw it so you could fetch it? Is that what you want? Yeah, I, I don't understand the Churchill has found something thing. It does... It just doesn't seem like it really works. Well, it's still raining, which is too bad, actually. All right, we're going to try to make our way through here. Well, I don't even think I hit that hooligan, which is a shame. There we go. Don't have to worry about that hooligan anymore. I feel like I just got some health, though. I thought that when I started this episode, there was a gap between my health and the rads, and now there's no gap. Oh, I slept. That's what happened. I slept. So, yes, indeed, I did get some health thanks to the sleeping. Okay. Well, we're going to try to make our way through here. This place is a mess. Just... Oh. Somebody over here, who's this? A hooligan pyro. Ouch, 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 ouch. Fire burn. Oh. Oh. Oh, don't flame Churchill. Oh, I can't believe how far that flame reaches. Um can't even see him. I'm going to try to hit him in the head, maybe. Only a 23% chance now. He'll try his left arm. We did hit him, but didn't do much damage. But then we missed him. Oh, gosh. I can't believe how far this guy could shoot his flames. Oh, Damn it. Holy hell. 
Well, luckily in this game we can pause while we rummage through our backpack for some aid. We need some serious aid here. In fact, it might be time to take a stem pack. Although, to be honest with you, I usually save stim packs for in the middle of a fight. Let's see, how can I sort these? Value, weight, just value or weight, that's it. Okay. Um, well, really don't want to spend a lot of time on this. But let's go ahead and eat. Boy, that's a lot of rads on those sardines. Kind of like to, whoops, what did I just do? Kind of like to eat some of this stuff. to um, free up some weight and heal myself at the same time. But holy moly, I can't believe how far that guy can shoot that freaking flame. And now I, I think I'm must have a Am I lost here? Is this the way we were going before? I don't even know. I totally got turned around in my panic as I ran away. And it was panic. Oh, son of a gun. Oh, doggone it. I tried to back up and I couldn't. I don't know if it's because Churchill was behind me there. gonna take a stem pack I won't that still won't heal us completely take another one oh this is um we're back here by the cops again I don't want to shoot them a ticket stash six tickets added Okay. I can't believe how much of a mess this place is. Holy cow. Fuck on it. <laughs> oh, Churchill. Oh, buddy. That didn't sound too good. Here he comes. bus here that we could look at. You never know, there might be some health on it or something, or food. I'm not finding anything. Oh, I can't get through here to go around. Man, I am really worried, worried about running into that pyro again. That guy was serious. And the rain... Didn't seem to help us any. Didn't help to quench those flames at all. This is a... This is a difficult game. Got a beef eater over here. Let's see if we could just walk on by. Monument Underground Station. Guess that's what that is right there. Oh, a hooligan. Some shotgun shells. I don't think I need any of that other stuff he's got. Is this a door? It is a door. I don't know if I can unlock advanced things. Oh, I can. Well, it doesn't get any easier than that. Maybe this will take us down to where we need to go. 
rediscovered monument. Check that out. A lot of places for people to hide. Caution. Cyber pigeon? What? Cyber pigeon? This thing's probably going to tear me a new one. Oh. Ah, crap. Look at my guy there. Check him out. Wow, that, that was not an easy kill. Churchill was helpful though. Cyber pigeon? What? Oh man, it looked like his body was here and then it just disappeared. I don't like enemies that when you kill them, you don't get anything from them. I don't like that. Ooh, a tape. The Silent Streets. Let's take a listen to this. This is an eerie graveyard now. No life, no laughter. Just the haunting echoes of what was. We tried to maintain order, to protect those we could, but ah, it's a losing battle. I fear the darkness that shrouds London now is a darkness that will never lift. Every step through these abandoned streets, it feels like a painful march into the void. A void that swallows not only the present, but also the past. Leaving only the emptiness of what might have been. How poetic. <laughs> Churchill, you crack me up. Another body over here. A skeleton. It just says skeleton. Quick calibrated 9mm pistol. That sounds good. Alright, I'm getting a little distracted here. Getting, uh... Further away from where I need to go. Some rounds and some hypo in that chem cooler. Their body over here. Let's just take a quick gander in here. Monument open. Oh. Yo. Only monument hatch key can unlock. Whoa. Well, we're going to have to see if we can't find that key. Looks like there's some stairs or a ramp or something that goes... Oh, here it is. Sure enough. Okay. The... Huh? Um... Something can go... Fuck themselves, I think is what this says. And I think it might say gent the gentry. Yeah. Got a body here. Excuse me. This is kind of neat. Whoa. This place this this place didn't look this big from the outside. To me. Huh. Oh, we found Ranger Ridiculous. Ballistic weapons permanently do plus 5% critical damage. That's cool. I like that. Roid, purified water. We got a teddy bear, fusion cells, shotgun shells. Let's see what's out here. Maybe we'll get a nice view of the of the land. Uh no, we will not.
Well, as needed as it, as it is being up here when it's raining, I do wish it was sunny so I had a better view. But it is London after all. My understanding is that it rains there quite frequently. Although I don't think it rained on us when when we visited London. Okay. Interesting. All right, boy, let's go back down. Apologies if this makes you dizzy. So, somewhere out there is a key to a hatch. That is intriguing. I wonder if there's any truth to that. I'm assuming this monument is a real place. I wonder if there's actually a hatch underneath of it. I don't know. Oh, Churchill. All right, what'd you find? Okay. Well, I was actually just on my way to explore back here. Don't think I need any of that other stuff. Thanks, thanks, Churchill. Appreciate it. A rad rabbit. I hate it when there's a rad rabbit in Vat's range because Vat's just, you know, generally will keep picking up the rad rabbit instead of actual enemies that I'm concerned about. place is just it's just so hard to see anything the ferryman dock house ferryman's dock house I mean maybe we're gonna go in there in a minute I don't know rum plunger because the ferryman and Archie are over in that direction. Let's go check it out since we're here. Oh. Rads. Oh. Oh. Oh, that's a... What? What? Why were there so many rads there? I don't really see anything that... Gives me rads. Hey, a record. Danny boy. Ferryman's dream. Let's listen. Let's really intrude. Labyrinth. That's got his grips on me. 
You might wonder. Oh, I'm stuck here. Varying folks across the teams. Even with my heart aches for that endless sea. It's because of that cursed Tim's Haven. That's why. They say it's my home. Down in those station tunnels. Deep beneath those waters. But all I found is a never-ending struggle. But in my dream, I'll sell above this station. The ancient wreck of Greenwich in the forgotten city of London and go into distant waves. I'm at peace under the sea where I belong. So here I am in this decrepit shack contemplating my dreams. Perhaps someday I'll find a way to break free from these chains and head out to the open sea. Until then, I'll keep ferrying souls, hoping that one day my dream becomes reality. And as I dream of the boundless sea, <laughs> No, I can't help but think. Why is the room always gone? Where is the answer to my dreams? The elixir of freedom. Just waiting for me to raise a toast to destiny. Well, he is quite the wordsmith. It's good to have a dream. I'm going to take this record. You've collected a copy of Danny Boy by Camilla's Choice. Well, I hate to take stuff from the ferryman, but I want to collect records. Danny Boy. Wow, you can't stop it. <laughs> you have to wait for it to finish playing. It's, it's nice. Well sung. I don't know why I got hit with so many rads when we walked in here. I don't see anything irradiated. So I don't know why it happened. I'm glad it stopped, but don't know why it happened. Okay, there's still more to this song. Wow, I can't believe I can't stop it from playing. Okay, well, we're probably going to come back here, so we'll be back. Probably. Well, let's finally meet up with the ferryman and Archie. Try not to step in this extremely irradiated water. I thought I heard gunshots. Maybe I do, I don't know. 
a little plastic plastic pumpkin here. Is Halloween celebrated in the UK? I don't even know. I can't tell whether there's gunfire going on over there or not. Barry? Hold in there, friend. You'll be as good as new. I feel violated. What is this? All right. One more reboot. Now. You made it! There you are. Do me a favor and send out a signal on that beacon up there. There's a beacon? Activate the beacon. Okay. Why do you want me to activate a beacon? Hey, Charlie, what's up? It's amazing how selfish people can be. They knew exactly what they were risking. Okay, I guess you're talking about the people before the war. Fire and brimstone. Feels almost biblical. What is going on over there? Um, Archie? Our ferryman? Welcome, friend. Glad to see you. Ah, hello there, human. All right, let's go up and put up the beacon, I guess. Mariner beacon, transmit. Uh, there you go. Try switching on your navigation system. Navigation systems online. Did it work? Yes. Well, don't sound too enthused. Okay, not sure what's going on here. But we're supposed to speak with the ferryman, so let's do exactly that. I hope the journey wasn't too formidable. Getting over the Thames is no easy feat without a vessel. Uh, about that underground laboratory, what do those beacons do? Who's your robot friend? Um, wh who's your who's your robot friend? What happened? This is Barry. My dear seafaring friend. A flock of pigeons laid a nest in his circuits. They washed up on the rocks. I'm not sure which happened first. <laughs> what do those beacons do? Barry's navigation data corrupted. Had to be wiped. Those mariner beacons transmit the data he needs to sail between places. Acting as a kind of waypoint. Without them, he'd be bobbing around aimlessly like a jellyfish. There's quite a few beacons along the Thames. Okay. Um, can we talk about that underground laboratory now? We retraced the boy's steps while searching for spare parts for Barry. It's not far up the road. Oh, wow. No way. That old monument. The tall one with the golden urn, atop a pillar. No way. From what I've heard, it was built to commemorate the first great fire of London. Hmm, okay. Um, did, did you go in? No. We kept a fair distance. Okay. Um, how many great fires of London have there been? Three. There was the original. That was before the war. Then there was the war. That was the second one. Then we had another one 50 years ago. And that's it for now. <laughs> the boy knows his history. Okay. Um, do you want to come with me? I'm in no condition to fight. Besides, I have a friend to take care of. I'm not ready to go back there. That place was horrible. Hmm. Well, then I guess I'll be on my way. Thanks. Wait. Those people I was with. They're the closest thing I have to family. Please rescue them. Or find out what happened. If you do, I'll know where that ghoul was headed. The one I escaped with. He might be able to help you. He said he knew about other labs. Here's <laughs> that key the boy swiped. No way. Good luck. No way. That is crazy. I can't believe that. We just happened to walk in there and see that. Explore the monument lab. 
Before we leave, let's see if Archie has anything new to say. Blimey, that's a lot of people. Blimey. They say there's a bunch of nutters milling about Croydon. Is that what they say? Uh, the ferry, the ferryman. It's always a pleasure to see you. Oh, thanks, man. So I think we also got another quest. I don't know if it's a miscellaneous quest. Uh, looks like it activate Mariner beacons. If I turn this on, um, well, it doesn't seem to point me anywhere. If I turn off lands of the Seraph, turn on activate. Mariner beacons. Yeah, it's not pointing me in any direction, so maybe we're not close enough to any of them. Hey, it's cleared up a little bit. That's nice. Why do you look so weird, Archie? Is it just is that just how your skin is? It's just light in the back and dark in the front? I mean, that's okay if it's like that. I just don't know whether that's just a glitch or what. Anyway, he does look like what are you what are you looking at? I don't know. Well, we're supposed to go back to that monument now. So let's do that. And we'll keep our eyes open for more of these beacons. We'll pick up some explosives. They could come in handy. Anything we could pick up that might help us survive. Security desk. Interesting. <laughs> uh, we have a cooking station. Do we have anything to craft? Let's check it out. Yeah, we do. We've got... Well, leeches again. I'm not going to use those because they use purified water. That might be all I've got. Yeah. I might have to drop those leeches so that every time I go to one of these it doesn't show that I have something to fix when I'm refusing to fix jelly leeches. Oh, uh, Churchill found something. What is it, Churchill? Is it that? <laughs> you weirdo. Why didn't you just go down this way? Uh, Rataway. Oh, Rataway. Good boy. Good boy. Found me some Rataway. Yes. Can't have enough of that. Oops. Oh, we got another bed here. Fishing poles. Okay. That's nice. Here we've got a silver pocket watch and some fuses, or a fuse. Alright. We're gonna go back this way, back to that monument. We're gonna duck our head back in here. I'm curious to see if that record stopped playing or if it, like, stopped and waited for us. Nope. It appears to have stopped. Does that record just automatically end up back in my inventory? Because it's not... Okay, it's back in my inventory. All right, that's cool. So I don't have to stop and listen to the record. I could just start playing it and then walk away and it'll magically end up in my inventory again. Well, it's nice and clear out here now. It's refreshing. There's the monument. Oh, okay. Oh! Okay, it's just a pigeon. It's not a cyber pigeon, I don't think. What'd you find, boy? What is it? It's looking in this direction. What'd you, what did you find? I thought I had a melee weapon in slot one, but I guess I don't. Do I have any melee weapons? 
still have the ballast song, but I want to use, um, wow. Well, that's weird. I thought I, I thought I had, I had kept another melee weapon. Well, the ballast song's the only melee, melee weapon I've got. Oh, the ferryman's friend. Oh, no, never mind. Okay. Uh, favorite in slot one. Okay. All right. Yeah. Okay, I was wondering if I could break my way through those. I, 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 I don't know what it was that Churchill was trying to tell us about. But, um, again, it tells us of something that I can't figure out. Well, here's the hatch. In we go. <laughs> oh, man. What in the world are we going to find down here? I'm going to crouch. Oh, my gosh. A machine gun turret. Yeah, that's a machine gun turret, all right. Are there, like, a whole bunch of machine gun turrets down here? Four machine gun turrets. Now, I don't know if they're active or not. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, that is so annoying when I have no bullet chambered and I go to shoot and it does that. Sneak attack for 2x damage. Did I destroy it? Doesn't look like I did. Okay, am I too far away from it to destroy it? Yeah, this thing still has full health. I'm not doing anything to it. That's frustrating. Well, I gotta get some light in here. Stealth be damned. The Mason's signature up there. I think. I think that's what that is. Look at this place. hide underneath the stairs if I have to. Yeah, I'm worried about... Oh! Investigate... Investigate the noise? Um, no thanks. I don't want to investigate the noise. So I'm going to walk in the opposite direction, thank you very much. Toolbox with some stuff in it. Hey, Wonder Glue, I think, is a, usually a pretty good thing to have. Apparently, I'm looking for those things also. Okay, so here's another turret. It doesn't seem to care about us walking around in here, so I'm not going to worry about them anymore. Heck, maybe they'll help us fight that scary sounding thing. Do I need an empty blood pack? I don't think I do. This is kind of awesome. I mean, yeah, look at that. It's dark down here, as it should be. The only light we've got is from those sparks there. That's awesome. It's an inconveniently placed terminal, and on top of it, again, is that symbol. There's a... what? What is that? What is that? Is it making that sound I'm hearing? 
I'm hearing a little be little just a faint beeping sound. Hear that? Nodding cow. Well, I took it. What on earth? Detective case file. What? Okay, I just took a detective case file. Is it just junk? Miscellaneous? Detective case file. Case file. So I guess maybe... We're going to find a detective at some point who wants us to find case files for him. Well, we found one. Power box. Unlock the door. Whoa. Whoa. I can't turn it off. Unlock the door, it says. So, okay, we've got a little bit of power in here now. We've got a little bit of light. That was just luck that I walked in that direction and saw that. I, I wasn't intending on finding a way to turn on power. But we found what we found it. Oh no. Yep, they're on all right. I kind of hate to destroy these because these could come in handy when it comes time to fight whatever the heck is down here. So, oh crap. Well, oh gosh, there's a bunch more of them up there, aren't there? Or did I? It's a green light up there that I thought was from a turret, but I guess not. So, yeah. Oh, gosh. Oh, oh, this is the way we came in. Okay, for some reason I thought I came in a different way. <sighs> That's chained up? I mean, who chained that up? Whoa. Okay, I guess this isn't the way we came in. Okay. the hell? What? Unlock requires terminal. Oh, oh, Churchill. Oh, buddy. Buddy, you can't let the turrets shoot you like that. Oh, Churchill. Oh, poor guy. Oh, buddy. I'm so sorry. So this is not the way we came in. I don't know what those things are. This looks like it was a safe, maybe? Sensor module. I don't know. I'll pick it up. It's different. Sure, silver pocket watch. I don't know. We got some... What appear to be military people here. Maybe they were trying to set up a barricade. Which way did I come in from? I don't even know anymore. I thought it was from that way. Maybe it's this way. Okay, this is the way we came in from right there. There's the ladder that goes up. Okay. Okay. All right. But the turrets, they're in that direction. Oh God, I'm, I think I'm going to have to destroy these turrets. Body here. Are these turrets on? Maybe these turrets... Oh, nope. 
Nope. Okay. I guess I have to destroy these. Ouch. And I, I really don't want to, but... I can't walk down that gauntlet. Right? I can't. Can't be done. Okay, so there's four of them there. None of them appear to be moving. I'm looking at my compass at the bottom center of the screen. I don't know if the light helps them see me or not. Ooh. We're going to have to be patient here. Wait them out. I may have destroyed that one, and indeed I did. hit it, but I didn't do much damage to it. Sneak attack for 2x damage. Though I think I might have just shot the one that was already destroyed. It's not doing a good job of hitting me. Oh. Okay, so there's two left now. Is it? Hmm. Well, I'd really like to see it before it sees me. Okay, I don't know why it's not shooting. Maybe I'm far enough away from it. I don't know. Oh, okay. One left. up. Reach level 10. Oh, I destroyed it. Not sure why it says caution. But I believe we've destroyed all the turrets. <laughs> this is awesome. This is so well done. So well done. This is really impressive. Well, I'm having a good old time playing through here, but I have to end this episode. When we come back next time, I guess we'll turn right and go down there. See what's up. Not looking forward to finding what made that sound. But we'll see if we can't find it in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for, for joining me on this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why don't you let me know? Let me like or a comment. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.